This is Kajol Jadav and I am here to explain daily current affairs for UPSC Civil Services exam. India's first private moon mission is in serious danger over contractual issue between Team Indus and ISRO's Antrix. What were the reasons for aborting India's first private moon mission? What is Team Indus? What is Chandrayaan 2? How will Chandrayaan 2 be deployed? Why was the Chandrayaan 2 mission delayed though it was planned to launch in 2015? GS Paper 3 Indigenization of Technology and Developing New Technology Achievements of India's in Science and Technology In this video, you can find detailed answers for all the above questions. The above article has been retrieved from indianexpress.com, dated January 11, 2018. What we are providing here is just a 10% sample out of the full-length video. Visit our website iasvideos.com to join the course and to unlock all videos. We offer this pendrive course cash on delivery on Amazon.in too. Amazon will deliver our course to your doorstep. What is the context about? With reports of cancellation of the contract between ISRO's Antrix Corporation and a Bengaluru-based startup, Team Indus, the launch of India's first private mission to the moon seems to be in danger. Team Indus' moon mission's aim is to land the spacecraft on the moon. Its mission to the moon is expected to last 24 Earth days, 10 days in orbit and 14 on the moon, and cover a distance of 3,84,400 kilometers. For launching purpose, Team Indus has signed an agreement and tricks the commercial arm of ISRO. What were the reasons for aborting India's first private moon mission? There are a lot of problems with Team Indus' mission on several fronts. The inability of Team Indus to raise the rupees 500 crore or nearly 70 million dollars for the launch phase is widely projected as the reason for the launch contract landing in trouble. The other reasons for this setback are questions raised over the contract in the higher echelons of the government, the failure of the PSLV C-39 rocket in September 2017, a clash between the timelines for the launch of ISRO's own Chandrayaan-2 moon mission, scheduled for March or April 2018. What is Team Indus? Team Indus is Bengaluru-based private aerospace company. It is led by Rahul Narayan. It has 100-member team of engineers, space enthusiasts, former Air Force pilots and former ISRO employees. It has high-profile investors including Ratan Tata of the Tata Group, Benny and Sachin Bansal, co-founders of Flipkart and Nandan Nilekani, co-founder of Infosys. What is Chandrayaan-2? India's second mission Chandrayaan-2 to the moon is more advanced than the first. The Chandrayaan-2 mission is being tested at an ISRO facility in Chitradurga, Karnataka. There are three components of the mission, or orbiter, a lander and a rover. The rocket ISRO is planning to use for Chandrayaan-2 is a GSLV MK-2 and will take off from the space agency's launch facility at the Sri Harikota High Altitude Range in the first few months of 2018. How will Chandrayaan-2 be deployed? The orbiter will be deployed at an altitude of 100 kilometers above the surface of the moon. The lander will then separate from the orbiter and execute a soft landing on the surface of the moon, unlike the previous mission which crash landed near the lunar south pole. ISRO is in the process of testing the actuators and sensors for a soft landing. A rover will then explode the surface. The lander 
rover and orbiter will perform mineralogical and elemental studies of the lunar surface. What was the Russian connection to Indian Chandrayaan 2? In 2007, ISRO signed an agreement with Russia to get technical support for the Chandrayaan 2 mission. According to the agreement, the Chandrayaan 2 mission was supposed to be a joint project between ISRO and the Russian space agency, Roscosmos. As a part of the agreement, Russia would provide the lander and the rover parts of the mission, while India would be responsible for the orbiter. The mission was originally planned for 2015. Why was the Chandrayaan-2 mission delayed, though it was planned to launch in 2015? Russian mission to one of the two moons of Mars failed. The mission failed and the two spacecraft ended up in the Pacific Ocean. Russia began a review of the mission and the future of the Chandrayaan-2 mission depended on that review. Russia pointed out that there was a high risk of failure if the rover went up in 2015 and asked India to supply the rover component. As a result, ISRO undertook a review of the entire Chandrayaan-2 mission. The integrated review recommended that India could provide both the lander as well as the rover components given a few years.